Holiday decoration thefts have made their way into the headlines lately, and now local law enforcement officials are encouraging folks to look out after a recent church theft in London. WYMT Sarah Anderson has some tips on how to keep your decorations out of criminal hands. Who steals a wreath? Nobody would steal a wreath. Leaves are disappearing from the trees, and so are some decorations from places in the mountains. The doors of Faith Assembly of God are bare after someone stole a wreath, and it was all caught on camera. I think everybody takes pride in their decorations and, and loves this time of the year. And when something is stolen and it's stolen from a church, it just kind of makes you think, well, who would do that and why would they do something like that anyway? Police say the church took the right steps to stop thieves, keeping areas well lit and adding security cameras, something they suggest people do at home. You can even get a deer trail camera and they're very inexpensive in today's world. Church leaders I spoke to said the surveillance footage made it look like these thieves were trying to steal these mobs, but the concrete pot might have made things a little bit difficult. Anyone can take the steps to prevent theft, but thieves will try to steal your things. Police say the best thing you can do if you are a victim of theft is to report it to authorities. We treat every theft and every burglary that we investigate very seriously. If we have any leads whatsoever, we follow up on them. As for those who stole from the church, Pastor Dan Collard has a message. We could have made them a wreath. No problem. Some ladies in the church would love to do that. So if they're watching, bring that one back. We'll make you one. No hard feelings. In Laurel County, Sarah Anderson, WYMT Mountain News. Now we have more tips on how to keep your decorations safe on our website, WYMT.com.